Hey guys, I hope you're having a good weekend. Um, I just wanted to jump on and show you guys something that I just noticed um, in the cut screen. So here I have these two images um, and I actually added the second image after I noticed this little feature a minute ago. But anyway, um, let me run over here. You can actually move uh, the items once you're in the cut, the cut screen, you can move them between mats. I did not know that until today. I guess I've missed a couple of tutorials maybe, but at any rate. So sometimes when I'm doing a project, um, I'll make the cut and then I'll realize, oh, I want it, I should have cut, you know, this piece in a different color or the way that, um, the designs might be arranged on the map preview here you know it may take two designs of the same color and put them on two different maps because of the way they're trying to place it on there and the sizing um, but apparently you can move them so what happened was I was trying to cut I was getting ready to cut this item here oh my gosh hang on y'all my dog is in distress hang on Okay, I think she's okay. <laughs> um, anyway, so I was going to move this around on the mat, and I noticed, like, I've always noticed this, where you can, you know, rotate the image on there, but never mind that. I noticed this little dot, 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 you know, and I'm like, okay, what information am I going to find there? So I clicked on it. And when I clicked on it, you know, I saw these two options. Oh, yeah, you can also hide an image from a mat. So say you're already in the cut screen and um, you've decided you don't want to cut a particular item out anymore. That happens to me a lot. And rather than having to go back in and hide it um, in the project screen, the design screen, you can now hide it here. So let me just show you that part real quick. So hide and it's not going to cut anything on this mat. I guess it's not going to tell you to load it since there's nothing there now. But anyway, you've hidden it. And down here, it tells you there's one item hidden. You want to bring it back. You just tap on there and bring it back. Anyway, the cooler thing, I mean, that's cool. But the cooler thing was being able to move this to another map. So when I saw this I went back into the design screen and created another image um, larger and in a different color just to see what would happen if I tried to move um, move the item onto a different color mat <coughs> excuse me so let's try it move to mat and then it shows you your mat and you can even create a new mat that's cool I didn't notice that when I was playing with it a minute ago I literally, literally just found this a few minutes ago. Anyway, Matt 2, confirm, come on, and there it is now on Matt 2, but it's also like it's on top, so like I don't know in this instance, because I don't think you can resize the image in the cut screen. Um, but, you know, let's just say that this image was not so big and they could both fit on the mat. Um, you can quickly change the color of the item you want to cut by moving it to a mat or creating a new mat. Let's go back and try that. Let's try that because I didn't play with that. And since I'm on showing you this, my mouse, of course, wants to freeze. Come back here. There you go. Let's see. New mat. Let's make it purple. Purple, I say. Come on. Oh, maybe, okay. Confirm, I guess. Oh, there you go. Okay. I thought it would <clears throat> give me some kind of indication that purple was actually selected before I hit confirm, but apparently not. So look, there you go. So then what's on this now? Wow, so I wonder if you could duplicate. What happens if I right click? Nothing. 
Nope, I guess you would have to just move it back to another mat. Anyway, I just wanted to hop on and show you guys that real quick because I just found it. I don't know how long that new feature has been there or if that's always been a feature. But anyway, now I know. And if you didn't know, now you know. Um, continue to enjoy your weekend, you guys. Take care. Bye-bye.